Well, thank you, and this is truly an honor, and looking at uh, the plaque down there, I think there's a mistake. I think it should say uh, thank you to Extension be for being a friend to Kendall Nichols. For 52 years, I've been involved with 4-H and uh, Extension. I didn't uh, think when I begged my parents to join 4-H 52 years ago that I'd be still involved. But uh, Extension has supported me and my family through the last uh, 52 years. And uh, six years ago, I joined the Soybean Council and uh, worked with a great uh, set of co-workers there and a board of, that has allowed us to reach into Extension's many, many talents and successes. Uh, we got some of the best researchers in the nation bar none. Think about uh, researchers uh, attacking the Palmer amaranth issue. Bill Hodes had vision to see that this was a weed coming to North Dakota. We were able to fund that. Brian Jenks is leading uh, effort out there. You move over to Carrington and we have uh, Greg Andres, Michael Wunsch, and uh, Mike Osley, who is one of my former 4-H'ers, uh, uh, they're doing great research. Uh, and uh, one thing I got to say is, if you haven't noticed, agriculture is kind of in a little of a issue. It reminds me a little bit of the 80s, but not quite the same. But if you think about the organization in North Dakota can make the greatest impact on this and lessen the impact. You think about the research extension centers, agents, and the researchers. Not only are the researchers great researchers, they're communicators. That research is taken out to our farmers and to the clientele throughout the state. So if I had a message today, it would be to uh, uh, Al Carlson in the legislature and Dr. Uh, or, uh, Governor Burgum, it would be, uh, don't think about cutting uh, the uh, budget of extension. Think about restoring what you took away two years ago. Thank you.